watching Card Player TV's This Week in Poker. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Lizzie Harrison and this is Christy Arnett. Our tournament reporters are hard at work right now in Spain covering the European Poker Tour event in Barcelona where almost 5 million euros are up for grabs. 620 players enter the tournament and the players who have made it through their respective day ones are all in the same room today as they attempt to make it through day two. The chip leader as of the taping of the show is Sebastian Ruthenberg. Other pros who are still in contention include a big stacked Poker Stars pro, Chad Brown, and a short stacked EPT Grand Final Champion, Glenn Chorney. Quite a few well known players have already hit the rail, and that list includes Joe Cassidy, Gavin Griffin, Scotty Wynn, David Benjamin, and Dan Ogranu. The event will wrap up this Sunday, the 14th. Sunday is a big day for major tournament action because, as the EPT event crowns a champion in Barcelona, another big buy-in tournament will begin in Atlantic City, New Jersey. The $10,000 buy-in World Poker Tour event kicks off at 11 o'clock in the morning. If you want to play, make sure to be there this Sunday because unlike many WPT events, this tournament has only one starting day. Card Player TV will be there for the entire main event to bring you tournament updates and interviews with the players. The tournament team will also be there to provide you with live updates, photos, chip counts, and recaps of the action at the end of each day. The preliminary events at Borgata have already been drawing huge numbers. The first tournament, which had a $300 buy-in, attracted 1,192 players and the winner earned a whopping $77,000. The pros have arrived early to acclimate themselves to the time zone and they have clearly settled in with quite a few caches. One standout is John Gale, who beat 482 players to take down the $400 buy-in No Limit event earlier this week. For his victory, Gale earned more than $55,000, and that put the WPT champion's lifetime earnings at almost $2.8 million. The Asian Poker Tour recently announced that they have signed three top-notch pros as representatives. World Series of Poker bracelet winner Quinn Do, World Poker Tour champion Nam Lee, and World Series of Poker bracelet winner and World Poker Tour champion J.C. Tran now represent the APT and they will be traveling to tournaments all over the globe as ambassadors. For these talented young players, this sponsorship deal was a long time coming. They have a combined total of more than $12 million in earnings and all of that money was won in the last five years. Their deal was inked in Macau because they were all there to play in an APT event. The APT tournament was followed by a high rollers event with a buy-in of almost 20,000 U.S. dollars. The nearly half a million dollar first place prize money was taken down appropriately by Nam Lee. His victory only solidified the APT's confidence in one of their newest players. Quinn Do finished third in that same tournament and pocketed more than 150,000 U.S. dollars. Back here in Las Vegas, a charity tournament is scheduled for this coming Monday. The Old School vs. New School event, hosted by Greg Anthony and Jermaine O'Neal, is set to take place at the Hard Rock Casino. Other professional athletes who plan to compete include Amari Stoudemire, Jose Canseco, Sean Marion, and Spud Webb. There will be a red carpet event at 12.30 Monday afternoon, and the actual tournament will begin at 1.30. All proceeds from the event will benefit the American Cancer Society and Operation Smile. The Hard Rock Hotel and Casino is going to be bustling with activity for the next few days as the casino opens its long-awaited poker lounge tomorrow. The red carpet reception starts at 5 o'clock p.m. and at 6 o'clock there's a VIP tournament. For those of you who want to catch a glimpse, it's located across from the Pink Taco. The Poker Lounge will feature daily tournaments in addition to the usual cash games, all in an environment that is not quite like anything you have ever seen before. And that sums up This Week in Poker. Thanks for joining us. I'm Christiana. And I'm Lizzie Harrison for Card Player TV. Have a great weekend and remember to join us at Borgata.